you may find that for other viewers of your website uh, that your images, Google Docs, uh, Google Slide presentations, and that sort of content is not uh, displaying properly for them. It might show a broken image or broken um, link icon. Uh, for people other than you. And what that probably means is that the sharing settings for those uh, elements uh, are, are too restricted. So let me show you what, what I mean by that. If I, uh, a, a good idea might be to create a, por um, a portfolio folder so you can put all the contents that are going to end up in your portfolio in the same folder. You don't have to do that, but it, it can make things simpler. Uh, if you do that, you can click this box and it will select all of the contents of that folder. And then you can go up to your share button here to look at the sharing settings. So here it says who has access and it's only people at the Pinewood School. So people who are logged in with their Pinewood School account can view. So I'm going to change that and I'm going to say anyone with the link. So that, that's a pretty good setting because it means anyone that you were to email the URL of your portfolio to would then be able to view, view it properly. View, see all your images and docs, etc. And I'm going to leave this button at anyone with a link can view. I don't want to change it to can comment or to uh, can edit, but instead just view. So that's going to be a good setting for most people's portfolios and allow you to share it with others and have all your content display properly. You can also adjust the sharing settings of individual pieces of content. So here we have uh, Anna Banerjee's pretend essay and I could just go up to this the share button again, click that and again I have my uh, sharing options that I can adjust right here. And that's how you make sure that everybody can see the content of your portfolio.